Good day my avid fans, welcome back to the channel for your latest dose of royal news. Prior to talks over the Duke and Duchess's conditions of their departure from the royal family, Her Majesty is to hold meetings to decide who takes up their roles. The Queen has planned emergency meetings with aides with Buckingham Palace, set to bring forward a series of announcements before March 31st. Such are the plans put in place by Her Majesty. Royal sources have claimed matters will be settled before March 31st, 12 months after the Sussex's departure. According to reports, Prince William and Princess Anne are set to take Harry's Captain General role of the Royal Marines. As well as holding the role of Captain General of the Marines, Harry is also Air Force Commandant of RAF Base Hongington and Honorary Commandre in Chief of Small Ships and Diving. He is also the patron of the Rugby Football Union, Rugby Football League and the London Marathon. Meghan also holds patronages with the National Theatre and the Association of Commonwealth Universities. The patronage of the Association of the Commonwealth Universities and the Queen's Commonwealth Trust are both set to be at risk. Although Meghan is set to lose her patronage of the National Theatre, some board members are split as to whether to ask the Duchess to step down. A source added, There was great excitement when Meghan took over from the Queen, but now it's tinged with a great deal of sadness over her lack of action for the theatre and the industry as a whole, which has suffered so greatly throughout the coronavirus crisis. It is thought their more private patronages, such as the Invictus Games, will be retained. The discussions over patronages came after US broadcaster CBS announced it will air a tell-all interview between the couple and Oprah Winfrey. According to friends of the US icon, she will be given free reign to ask the pair of their life as royals, their charitable work, and the inside story of how they stepped away from the firm. The 90-minute show will be broadcast on March 7th, almost a year since they left the royal family. Following the announcement of the interview, Buckingham Palace confirmed the pair are not required to consult officials. As Harry and Meghan are no longer working royals, they are not required to do so. A separate CBS statement said, Winfrey will speak with Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex, in a wide range in interview, covering everything from stepping into life as a royal, marriage, motherhood, philanthropic work, even how she is handling life under such intense public scrutiny. Later, the two will be joined by Prince Harry as they speak about their move to the United States and their future hopes and dreams for their expanding family. There's your latest royal news all about the Sussexes as per usual. Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment and subscribe. See you tomorrow and goodbye for now.